I'm going to explain why we have the heat in place right now. So today we hit 102. That's not a record. The record today is 113. Tomorrow we're going to hit 105, not even close to a record. The record high tomorrow is 112. So hot temps indeed across the area, but this is certainly dangerous heat. It's and it's not that unusual for us to have temperatures like this. As I mentioned, we're not even in the record territory, but please don't take this too lightly. What's responsible for this big ridge of high pressure and look at this across the state. Those purple areas or whatever color, purple, pink, whatever that is. Uh, those are excessive heat warnings. So clearly it's all of North Texas that goes through the day tomorrow and most likely into the day on Thursday. All those orange areas are heat advisory. That's a big chunk of the state. East Texas, uh, upper Texas coast, southeast Texas, a big chunk of West Texas as well under that heat advisory. So what's creating all of this right now across the area? Well, it's all high pressure. It's that big H that I just showed you. That big H is creating sinking air. So high pressure uh, causes the sinking air. As the air sinks, it compresses and it causes it to heat up. And it's this sinking air that also limits our cloud and storm development. So we've had clear skies. We, we haven't had any rain, no cloud cover. So again, temperatures just soar. And when you have this big dome like this, this big dome of high pressure on top of you, all of these factors combined, they act like that dome and it just traps all of that heat at the surface right where we are. It doesn't have anywhere to go. We don't even have any strong winds to blow it away. So we're just stuck under this big dome of high pressure.